Hello guys, welcome to today's video by Trust Stanley and this is a TS Tech Talk video. On today's video guys, I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook page and we are going to be making use of the Facebook application to do this. And then guys, quick information, the Facebook page I'm going to be creating, I'm going to be actually creating a Facebook page for a video game. Now, what it means is actually people that are into video gaming, um, when you create this page, people can easily click and download the game you created on Facebook. So let's dive into that. So I'm going to open the Facebook application, click on the menu section and now click on pages. And now I'm going to click on the create icon on the top right area. And then there is a lot of information right here, but um, do not mind that. Let's just ignore it just so that we don't spend too much time on this video. Click on get started and then go ahead and give it a name. So I'm going to call this real for ball match. And then I'm going to click on next and it's asking for a category. Um, I actually wanted to make sure I have copied the game. This is the link to the game download. So I needed to copy it. I have copied it and then I need to complete this game. So the first thing I need to do is to select the category of the game. So since it's a video game, I'm going to first add game and then it will display categories from the game so i'm going to select a video game and now i'm going to click on next and it's asking for a website which is um the link i just copied right now from the play store or if you have a website link where people can click on um probably uh, a landing page you can go ahead and enter it right here but i do not have so i'm going to paste this right here and then click on next and now it's asking for a cover image and a profile i already have a profile but i do not have a cover image so i'm going to click on add profile right here and i'm going to select this and this is actually the game so i'm going to click on save and under this um cover image i do not have a, any particular cover image so let me see if i'm going to get um a nice graphics image of my device so let me just add this instead and um okay that is enough and then i'm going to click on save and then i'm going to click done so um this is actually the image but guys if you're working on if you're working on your page make sure you have something professional so if you are the type of person that is actually making use of um facebook page and you want people to contact you um, you can go ahead and leave this option, but I do not want this to be displayed on my page So I'm going to ignore that and now it listed important information So just click on next and now you notice it says add image um, Add image that people will first see um, on your page um, Like use a logo. So I'm just going to click on this and since I already have that I'm going to click on save um, the reason why it actually displayed that is um, just in case you do not have image you've added and now it's saying invite people but i do not want to invite anybody to this um, page this is just a tutorial for now and now it's saying um, join groups um, really this is not necessary so you can join if you want to and connecting of the whatsapp is actually for some businesses that actually want people to customers to reach them easily or quickly but i do not want that particular option so i'm going to skip and now it says create a post now uh, making a post you can go ahead and leave an information that people will be interested in so i'm going to come over to this area click on the game um actually wanted to click on the game and then i want to get an image right here so i'm going to take a screenshot and then come over to the facebook create a post and now i'm going to say From Google Play Store and now um, I can easily add the image which I saved which is this one and then um, I can also add the link I already copied so I'm going to go to the clipboard okay this is it and now I'm going to click on share and then it's going to be shared on the news feed and I'm okay with that so go next and now you notice it says set up automated image I necessarily do not I really do not need that for now and now it says um, add learn more and um add a messaging so um the only button where that i want is actually the button where people can um click on to either download the game or play the game so i'm going to click on this learn more option and then i'm going to paste an option of the link and i'm going to click on create 
So um, you say something went wrong. That is because I already added a link before. So let's keep out and it says add a website and add hours to your business. So I'm just going to click on this getting started. You notice this is still where it brought me. So I do not need all of this right now. But then um, I'm going to close this out. So come right here and then I'm going to refresh. Now everything is displaying the way I want them to see. So uh, this is just how we created our Facebook page. Although there are even more settings we can do guys to um, further configure the settings on your Facebook page. All you need to do, you notice this gear icon on this top area. Go ahead and click on that gear icon. When you click on this section, you can come to your page info and make any changes you want. For instance, the naming of your page, you can go ahead and edit the name of your page to whichever name you want or probably you think that is acceptable. And then under this description section, you can add a description about your game. That is if you want um, people to come. And then this... um action button is actually what you want people to do when they visit your page so i always like that option action button to be there so um the action button that i'm going to add is the one that says play game now because it's a video game so i want people to actually play the game so i'm going to paste this link this is a link to um the play store so i'm going to click on create you should be able to create this now it says something went wrong i do not know exactly the reason why it says something went wrong but this actually works very well but do not worry guys um later on i'm going to try to add this on the pc most times it always gives this issue when you are making use of the mobile app but when you are doing it on your desktop it doesn't give this issue so but the button i want to add is actually this play game so um let's see you say um add link to your page i'm just going to type in i'm just going to say hash and then create let's see okay it still rejected the link for some reason um i wonder the reason why it rejected our link and rejected this one also but do not worry guys we are going to fix that up later so this is all i want to show you guys on today's video you can notice there are even more settings that you can do in the page but really the only thing i want is for them to visit and then um when they visit the page click on play the game and then they will be able to play the game now let me click on see us let's see how people will see the page this is exactly how people are going to see the page when they visit for the first time and now um this is incomplete because the button is not displaying so i want the button to actually display so um we are actually going to um give it some time and then um find out the reason why this didn't work and then i'm going to make more video about it so i hope this video is helpful if it is please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video i will see you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace